It's Valentine's Day. So this is the kind of project you can sit in front of like a cheesy romance movie and do because it's just fiddly and fun. You should honestly just try to wear hearts on your outfit every day of February. Hi everybody, I'm ALB and it is Valentine's Day and what better to do on Valentine's Day than wear your heart on your sleeve. Because today we're going to be making glittery heart patches. Here's what you're going to need some red felt, a Sharpie marker, a heart template, sequins, now I have some loose sequins and I also have sequins on a roll, a piece of clothing that you would like to decorate with a heart, we're gonna use a sweater today, scissors, some pins for sewing, paint brushes, translucent thread and a sewing needle, and lastly, some fabric glue. So first off, I'm gonna show you how to make your actual heart. What you're gonna do is first take your felt. Now, you can technically make a heart in any color. I know you can, but we're gonna make red today because it's just so quintessentially Valentine's Day. And we'll take a little heart template here and just trace it right on the felt. And once you have it drawn on your felt, you just have to cut it out. Doing this sort of thing with hearts totally reminds me of being in grade school and like getting valentines for everybody in the class and putting them in valentines boxes, little mailboxes. Ugh, I wish we still did that as adults. There we go. So this is what you've got. Now we're gonna be putting the sequins on our heart. I really like buying this kind of like sequin on a string sort of thing, which you can get at fabric stores or craft stores. I really like also using translucent thread for this because it just looks better on a project. So we have our needle on a translucent thread now with a knot tied at the end. And I'm gonna start around the outside of the heart and work my way in. So if you're using a loose sequence instead of sequence on a string, it's just as simple. From the underside of your heart, put your needle through and thread a sequin onto your needle. We're basically just sewing the sequins right onto the felt. And because the thread is translucent, you can't really see that it's been stitched there. So it just looks really shiny and glittery and perfect. I personally prefer to use the sequin on a string because it just makes life a little bit easier. So basically we're gonna go around the outside of the heart as we slowly fill it in. It takes anywhere from 15 minutes to half an hour to fill in the entire heart on a size like this. When you've got to the middle, you just tie a knot and Flip it over, it's perfect. Nice, so we're all done. You fill in all of your glitter heart and it looks so sparkly and amazing. I love it so much. Okay, so now we get to pick a spot on our clothing where we're gonna put it. I know approximately where I want my little heart to be. I'm gonna take some of the fabric glue. And then when the back of your patch is covered in an even layer, we can very carefully place it exactly where we want it to go. Now, you really wanna give this proper drying time. There we go. Oh, I love it so much. Now, I think this looks awesome and I wanna keep this sweater with this heart on it for a long time, so I'm gonna go ahead and sew around the edges of the patch. And there we go. Oh, I love this so much. I just love these patches. They're such a great way to upcycle older clothing. They just add such a little oomph for something extra to your outfit. For the full tutorial list, head on over to cbc.ca slash life. Thanks for watching. Happy Valentine's Day.